Welcome to Mercy J Auto Care, where compassion and craftsmanship come together. I'm Rick Smith, Certified Master Technician. Let's talk about why does my car shake at high speeds? And as a matter of fact, maybe does it shake just while cruising at all? First of all, if it happens between 65 and 75 miles an hour in that range, and it goes away above or below that, then almost assuredly it's gonna be a tire balance issue. Now, if you've had your tires balanced and still have the problem, you might wanna make sure you have somebody who has a road force balancer balance those tires. That equipment's kind of expensive, so you might have to shop around just a little bit. But if the vibration or shaking occurs at say 30 or 35 miles an hour, here's kind of a little test to do. You go into a residential area or a parking lot, turn the wheel all the way. While you're going slowly, let go of the steering wheel. As it returns to center, if it bounces in a cyclical motion, most likely you do have a tire problem. Now, also, you can jack the car up, spin the tires while viewing them from the front or the back of the vehicle. And if you see like an egg-shaped look to the tires, then you probably have a tire problem as well. Now, not all shaking is tire related. We also have axles and drive shafts. Those are gonna usually have a little bit higher frequency vibration, and they are typically gonna change with load. So what I mean by that is if you're cruising, you're experiencing the shake and you let off the gas or give a little bit more gas and it goes away immediately without vehicle speed change, then you need to address the axles or the drive shaft. So I hope this information has been helpful to you today. And until next time, safe travels to you and blessings.